the format of being robot. Who here has heard of an app called Discord? I'm sure many of you have, but for those who haven't, all you need to really know is that it's a free alternative to the likes of TeamSpeak and Skype, primarily for gamers to use. I've used it for a good year or so now, as me and a few friends started using it instead of Kick, after my first girlfriend broke up with me and started ignoring me altogether. Everything's been well since then, except for a few arguments and mishaps, but it's a much more organized way for me to keep contact with my friends, since it lets me do my coding and art projects whilst being able to keep a consistent voice chat with them. I never thought anything creepy could come of it, the creepiest thing that had happened up to this point was a friend having posted a freaky gif to our group chat before we all logged off to sleep for the night. Although, these events are freakier than that, at least to me. It seems it only happened to me too, making things worse. Now it's nothing unbelievable like that a random guy joined our call and sent strange messages and then killed us, crap, this is something else, and I hope you can believe me. As much as I hate recollecting these events, I've already made my decision to publicize them, and see if anyone knows what happened. So, here goes. It was late on the night of June 9th, around 11.42 p.m. Me and another friend were still awake and chatting on Discord, after one other friend had been told he wasn't allowed to come on our day trip that upcoming Wednesday, leaving the chat since he got really mad about it. Our other friends were asleep. Well, one friend asleep and the other friend watching YouTube videos whilst claiming to be asleep. With only two of us left, we were stuck with what to talk about, just spitting out random topics trying to catch conversation. Then, out of nowhere, I heard Discord's leave call sound constantly playing on loop. I clicked back onto the app to see that it was having trouble connecting. Right away, I knew it wasn't my internet, as I had been using it just fine a few seconds before. So all I did was sit by and wait for it to stabilize, and eventually it did, sort of. I was connected into a call by myself, with everyone in my friends list and DMs being shown offline, and all the servers I had joined no longer being available, just giving me an error message saying the usual 11 servers are currently unavailable, or 11 in my case at least. It was very strange to say the least, but given nobody else in my group was online, I just assumed they'd gone to sleep after I disconnected. It was later, after all. So I got back to doing what I was before, although not long after, I heard the member join sound, making me click back to Discord. There, it showed that my friend from before, L Trains, had joined the call. I asked where he went and he explained to me that there were some connection issues on his end, to which I told him the same happened with me. I looked on the official Discord Twitter, and nothing about server errors were posted. I then looked at the Discord status page, and again, it said nothing was wrong. Me and L Trains continued talking for a bit, when I mentioned that nobody else was online and the servers were inaccessible. He told me the opposite, with another of our friends being online, although not in our call. My heart stopped for a moment. He wasn't the kind to joke around, so I knew right away he was telling the truth. I told him I'd restart Discord quickly, so I pressed Ctrl R to restart the app. As I did, it didn't load back up, instead leaving me at the connecting screen. As I was about to click off Discord, something faded into the background. It showed my group friends list, completely empty, and the sidebar showed nothing but faint circles instead of those I had DM'd. This was getting to be a little bit freaky now, so I decided to close Discord altogether and open it again, hoping that would work. Once again, I was sent to the same screen. But this time, my friends list was replaced by the no ones around to play with Wumpus message, the placeholders in the sidebar being more clearly visible, and it stated I had no friends online rather than being blank. I was somewhat scared, but I really cannot pinpoint why. Everything happened so suddenly and it struck me with fearful feelings. Regardless of those feelings, I just shut down my computer and went to bed for the night. The next day, I went on Discord at 5 p.m. as usual. Two of my friends were online, both being part of our group chat, so I asked them what happened after I disconnected last night. L Trains told me that he thought I left for the night, as Discord worked fine for him. 
I explained to everyone what happened to me and showed them the screenshots. Thankfully, they believed what I told them, although even I struggled to believe it had happened. I can only hope that you believe me too. In retrospect, I should have screenshot the moment of when I got placed in a call by myself, so all I can ask is that you take my words for truth and believe that I didn't mock up the screenshots. What happened and why, I really do not know, I've only installed a plugin that lets me make my own custom themes but it never acts up this way when I get disconnected. These events might not make much sense, but I must ask you to believe me when I say that it's all the truth.